Cosmic dust is the name that we give to solid particles that float around in space between stars. It's basically the origin of everything. It's about where we came from, where life came from, where planets came from, but it's also incredibly important in allowing stars to form. My name is Hayley Gomez. I'm a senior lecturer in astrophysics at Cardiff University. Doing my undergraduate degree at Cardiff, I was supervised by an amazing professor. I remember him saying that we are all stardust. We come from the dust that is made by stars. I think the idea that a star that's blown up is responsible for us being here on Earth is just so poetic. My research is all about trying to understand where cosmic dust is made, how it's made and when it's made. We found huge amounts of dust forming after the explosions of stars and that wasn't really seen by anyone else before. The feeling of that discovery, the greatness of that feeling, pushes you to do it again and again. I'm a bit obsessed with dust but normal astronomers hate it because it acts like a smoke screen. It blocks out around half of all the light in the universe. I'm also trying to understand what can we do to see behind that smoke screen. The next step is to build telescopes that are more sensitive, they can see further away, they can see the first galaxies and even the first stars after the Big Bang. Cardiff University's approach to innovation is very collaborative. It's gone from the idea of, of academics being a lone genius and, and working on their own. And I think Cardiff has moved away from that in a very positive way to kind of work together. Now is a great time to be part of Cardiff, to join our family. Cardiff has moved from being quite quiet about itself to now showing off to the world the great research it does. It's well known, it's well respected. We work a lot with people all across Europe, all across the US, and the work done in their school is instrumental for pushing the boundaries of technology to build the biggest, best telescopes to see all the light in the universe. To be able to see dust in galaxies that are extremely vast distances away, you have to build detectors that are very sensitive. And these detectors are now going to be used as non-invasive security scanners at airports, non-invasive medical tests, um, particularly with skin and eyes. So there's this real impact from what we look at up there to what we use on Earth. I think the wonder that I have about the universe, that's really drives me not only to do my research but to also pass that passion on. So I spend a lot of time with students who also inspire me to do work and also to go out into schools and to talk to kids about the wonders of, of the universe. Without the support I've had from the university I wouldn't be able to do the research I do today. Me within the university allows me to be better.